Those guys play the games that they like, the games that they love, the games that they might just loathe. Those guys play in these games, play in these games, so watch them play some games. Yeah. Yeah. Meh. Hey, everybody. Welcome to another episode. This is when I was supposed to say episode one, but I didn't. And we didn't even film this out of order. This was actually the first episode. Oh man, I'm great. Of those guys play season six. If five was cool, I could go like that, but I'm like six. So it is Matt. It is Matt. It is Patchy, and attached to Patchy is Tristan. Uh, now, this is a game that I wanted to play, and by I mean you, and I agreed because I you know because you wanted to play this game for a while. I've said not sure when we can slide this in. We were going to try to do it for Halloween in July, but and stuff I said, happened. Blasphemy. <laughs> stuff happened. Yes. Um, then, not blasphemy for Halloween in July, just because you wanted to get it in sooner. And then that didn't get to happen. And then I was going to do it for Halloween, but thankfully, and this was really cool, uh, one of our viewers, Vishtix, who also has a channel of his own, going to post it in the, uh, in the uh, description box down below. He actually said, hey, I actually was able to get a, um, I don't know if he had an extra copy or something like that, but he had a digital copy of Fear 3. Would you guys like to play it? Right. So the two of us yeah. dressed up for Halloween. We had a great time. And I didn't know how much of a first-person shooter it was, so I was like, oh, my goodness, and because I felt like Grandpa. And so it was so much fun. So I'm really like, so again, I thank him. But then Tristan was like, so, Matt, when are we going to play Killer 7? And I was like, all right there, bud. So, uh, we actually ended up, you know, we decided, we both looked at each other, and we knew those guys play season six. So, Tristan, <laughs> I need you to tell me why this game is important to you. Why have you been pushing this on me I for, for, just since middle reason. school? No, literally, no, because okay, I've been, is... since middle school, people have been telling me, yo, dude, you have to play this, and I somehow haven't. So, why, I mean, why since middle school? It's, it's a cult classic, but it's mm -hmm. also um, Suda51. Create same creator as No More Heroes. Yeah. Okay. Um, so it's it's really out there and it's weird, but it it's just right for all the reasons that it and, is. And I will be playing game. it because yeah. if you played it, it'd be too easy. I will be oh, playing it. I didn't say that. Oh, okay. I'm saying it because <laughs> oh. there's there's modes. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, I'll be playing yeah. it on its easiest mode. How dare you? I've never played it before. I know. <laughs> yeah, it's it, it's. An experience, I'll put it that way. But it is okay. also very okay. referential, like in a, not like to specific. Well, maybe to a few things. But okay, like, so it's fun. It's a lot of fun. Any tips before I begin? I gotta sit up. I gotta get ready to go. Uh, what? Any tips for this game? Thank you, thank you so much for your kind tips. Trust in the gimp. Well, I'm pretty sure that's the sound of YouTube taking us off YouTube. Thank you the all. The best part uh, of it is, I'm not lying. <laughs> all right, so this is going to be a fun one, everybody. Let's do this. I don't know what's going on, but what I do know is is that we actually had to put the audio on this time. Tristan, you told me that it's audio important. is yeah is important yeah. for this. Yeah, um, in the best way possible. What do yeah. I what do I do? So yeah, for anyone, scroll up to the first one. Yeah, Killer Seven. Okay. Because eight and Hopper and are, new game, of course. Yeah. Options. Let me see what's on options. Ah, none of that. Heaven smile. I do have to say though, like yeah, going into this, thank you. Yeah. Like, I, I am so happy. That no, I mean we're again, you know, we wanted right to. Do, I wanted to do this with uh, with you for years, but for some reason, you and I would both forget around Halloween and then or yeah. October, and then we'd never talk about it until like June, maybe, or right. before Halloween in July. I mean that, and it did take me a while to actually get. Did I do oh. the right thing? I just clicked on Angel. Was that bad? Yeah, no, no, no. That's fine. Okay, so Tristan was worried about the fact that he thought that the controller was drifting. Yeah, it was. See, other things other than Joy Cons drift. Okay. You can. Ooh. Yeah. So, like you've been telling me, you've told me before, Tristan, this game's a trip. Oh, yes. Yeah. And, like, you you get things out of it, but, like, don't expect it to make sense. <laughs> oh, 
Okay. It's one of those. And I know, like, that won't bother you. No, but what I like about it is is that I feel like a lot of those games never really made it over here. Yeah. So I'm happy that this one did. Yeah. Did he, did Suda51 do another sense. game before this that was oh, yeah. big enough? Um, I think this was, like, his... Breakout in America. Yeah. I'm only bringing it up because... Because he has had It's other interesting this. that this... I mean, I know the GameCube is maybe going for this audience. Yeah. Like, with these types of graphics. Yeah. But it's interesting that um, this game even came out. Yeah. Because sometimes, especially on the PS1, they would never put out a game like this, I feel. Yeah. Not never, never. Because this like, came out for ah, GameCube like never. and PS2. PS2. Yes. I don't want to say never, never. But what yeah. I'm trying to get at, though, Tristan, is that uh, it... The way you describe it to me and others describe it to me, it seems so weird and unique for its for its time that it seems like any other game that was like this was squashed and left in Japan. Like, it was never localized and brought over here. Yeah. For the most part. Now, yeah. obviously, a, 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 you know, it's not a hard and fast rule, but yeah, it seemed to happen a lot. It's me. So, you there yet? You mean this shit old? <laughs> That's where they all hang out. That's where they Our information out. tells us that there's 14 of them. And they're all fun. Ah, I keep one alive so we can ask who the boss is. Anything else I should know? Eh, not really. You'll know when you see them, they're, uh, different. Will do. And may the Lord smile. And the devil have mercy. Uh-huh. Okay. And this is a shooter, if I remember correctly, right? Yes, it's a rail you shoot, shooter. You shoot the, the gun. Okay, oh, it's a rail shooter. So then the Heaven Smile are, um, they're a cult. Yes, they're technically a terrorist organization. Oh! Alright, this video is demonetized. But it's in the distant future of 2005. No, not 2005. But... Yeah. Whoa, what? Oh, it's... No, 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 it's the... Oh, this is why I remember this controller. Why I put this one in the box. So if there's one thing I learned from the tutorial, which you guys have not seen, is that I'm going to die. Oh. Uh, <laughs> horribly. I am not going to be good at this game. But dying. it's going to be fun. Yeah. Like, it, it's a steep learning curve at first, but once you get the handle on things... Oh, we're already getting into the thick of it. What even noise is she making? She's purring. Okay. Bathing herself. Oh, okay, cool. Got to the point where I'm like, I don't want to look at her, but like, what's going on? Whoa, what? <laughs> what's going on? <laughs> yeah. You don't want to go any further. Hey, Jimmy Neutron. It's dangerous. Is that really his voice? My friends are all her voice. dead. They were all murdered by people that look like... His first line. <laughs> Dan Smith. Dan Smith. The most American of names. Basically. <laughs> it's Bob Hamburger. It's look at that, it's oh. it's John Stedson. Yeah, e even the even the revolver he has too. Um I shoot it, right? No, no, he's he's on your side. I didn't know that. He you doesn't look like he's on my you, side. You talk to him. I, I didn't know if he was just well, a creepy dude. No, go introduce yourself. He was on. When I said trust the gimp, this is what I meant. We're in a tight spot. A real tight you spot. You are. Like uh, I haven't seen you for ages. Vincel Del Boris the Seventh. He's a Warzakov. At your service. Just call me a I'm sorry, who is the, uh, the cult? Well, you're a syndicate of assassins, and Harmon is the leader. It's also the save point. Not a bathroom, I see. 
No, they're just <laughs> interesting. Uh, Samantha. She saves your game. Thank you, Samantha. Oh, turn the TV on. Always remember to do that. Just to. to... Whoa, what's going on? Oh, the blood room. That's how you get experience. You use thick blood and turn it into serum. Do I do that now? No, well, you don't have any. You haven't killed anything. Oh, well, thank goodness. <laughs> you don't have any blood. You've got blood, but you can change the channel with the dial. Oh. I remember him. Yeah, you were just Wait in here. here. There's Dan. But oh, there's more. Did you notice? Can I click her and be her? Yes. Did you oh. What did you say? Later. Me. Meet the Killer Seven. So, is there one that you recommend? Wait I mean, here. my personal favorite is Dan. Now it's be Dan. Uh, B to change direction. Yeah. B is basically just to turn around, basically. You'll get used to it. I will admit, though, I really do enjoy... Like, you can tell that he wanted to make something for the Wii even before the Wii existed. Do you know what I mean? Like, he, yeah. he went very unconventional oh, yeah, with yeah. this. Like... Yeah, it's an on-rail shooter, but it doesn't mean that everything had to be like this. Every single part of it had to uh, be like this. Uh, uh, hit, hit R. Scan L. There you go. Ooh, <laughs> wow. I saw first it. First shot. Was I a saw crack. it. Yeah. Good job, man. <laughs> Bloody, Bloody hell. hell. Well, no, because I saw it and I was like, yeah. let me explain what my process is, right? Yeah. I screw up. Then my sphincter tightens, and then I get the shot. There you go. Clench. Nice. Everything is clenched. The shot, my... Everything. <laughs> okay, so now I can talk to Iwazaru. Yes. That's what Tristan's telling me. Granted, he would have stopped moving when you talked yeah. to him, but... Tighten out of sight. <laughs> Let me make a suggestion. You must turn back. What? This is the oh, so I don't have to turn back. No. Treasure to think. Their bodies are lined with Exactly. Bombs. Literally. Yeah. The font behind that is cool too. The yeah. way it's coming together ish. In the name of Harmon. And like again, who's the, the voice synthesizes like is it's, it's synthesizing it, it's, in Japanese or yeah, in English? I oh, okay. believe it's in Japanese. Yeah, yeah I yes. thought it sounds like it is. <laughs> and that's when you know to scan because you hear their laughter. Whoo! Nice. It's not always in the head though. Yeah. Thank God. I was trying to shoot his arm, but yeah. So when you get a crit, you get yeah. more blood from them, and you use the blood Got to it. level up. Oh, Travis. Hallway or Travis? Different Travis. But hallway or Travis? Travis. Okay. It's me. Me. You don't remember? Your chief oh, killed. okay, good. I was like, okay, good. I thought you were dead. <laughs> you already I was out. nervous. I was like, How, you have to be dead, I'm right? Travis. I'm the killer who got killed on the job. Let's totally be honest. So I can't be Travis. No. Tr but I guess. <laughs> you think I'm a pain in the ass. Hey, Smith, I ain't letting you go nowhere. Wait, what, what, what does that mean? He just follows you around. Oh, okay, cool. He's kind of like he was our room in that regard. Speaking of which, you have another good friend as well. <laughs> we're in a tight spot. Spoiler, we're always in a tight spot. <laughs> but don't be alarmed. I was told that the GameCube was for children and babies. I do not believe that assessment at this exact moment. I mean, Resident Evil 4 was out on the GameCube. I was told that this game was for children and or babies. Who told you that? Teenagers in the year 2019. No, a fair amount of people are under the impression that Nintendo equals yeah, Babby. No, I, I get you. But yeah. So the idea with... This other guy. Shoot him. When No. Oh. Whenever he's around, that means there's a soul shell around, which you need to basically fight the mini-boss of each level. Okay. So you have to collect all the soul shells. So I, but I should shoot something that breaks out the soul shell? Yeah. No, well, you'll actually pick up the soul shell after you kill what you need to, or you solve a puzzle, that kind of thing. So I should run to him? Yeah. Oh, I thought it's I had just, to do something before getting No, there. no. It's just him there is to signify you need to go here. Oh! Parking. I like parking. Mm. All right. Ooh, new enemy type. Com Camellia Smart. <laughs> it's okay. This one's not actually walking towards you. Yeah, talk to you was our... Oh. Uh, 
it's around it's around the corner. That's another thing. Like it's kind of like Resident uh, Evil in that respect because go. it's like camera angles. We're in a tight spot. <laughs> <laughs> the mayhem is out of control. Use the R button and press Y three times. Yeah. So it's the Helion is Dan's ability. Got it. Each smith has a different like. Got ability. it. Got it. The devil's pockets. Social. Or. Right. Okay. Yeah. They're basically powered up shots. Mm -hmm. But Dan's the Helion. Yeah. Just just unload on him. Go. Yeah. <laughs> Now you fight that. That's a nest, or a duplicator. So this is how there are more than 14. So there are just, you know, nests lying around that just, you know, pump these guys out. So yeah, on the left side of the screen where those vials are, um, when you have enough blood to um, fill up three vials, um, it'll, it'll glow, like, you hit Y three times. Unlimited so, ammo? Oh yeah, well, um, It'll automatically reload for you once you run out. <laughs> or you can flip the C stick to reload as well. So you, that yellow dot that's on the duplicator, you basically want to use the Helion to destroy that and it'll kill the duplicator. Sorry, I know it's a lot of info. Cool. Damn it, it was right there too. Yeah. I was, it was in his neck, not his head. Yeah. Yeah, those are tricky sometimes. <sighs> that and for like upgrades, you can also upgrade their waiver, which aim. So like your aim won't be as like shaky after a while. Right in the dick several times. <laughs> and at first, it's like that frustrating, like, mix of trying to shoot, yeah, directly, but, you know, them just. I mean, that's the whole eerie aspect of the heaven smile. They just, like, shamble towards you. That and they're invisible. Only the smiths can see them. So, if you're a random person, all you hear is their laughter. And that's basically the best part. And then you're no more. So what do I do now? Uh, well, you're at two vials right now of thick blood. So you need three to use the helium. <laughs> so you see that yellow dot that's up on the duplicate, yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. So when you have enough blood, oh, yeah, don't two. shoot them when they're invisible. It makes them speed up. Nice. So there's three now, right? Yeah, so we hit Y three times. You'll see the vials. Yeah, one, two, three. And I hit the yellow dot. Mm. And there's the helium. Excellent. Nice one. Unfortunately, now there's another rolling towards you. Oh, okay. Okay. Nice. You killed your first nest. All right. Good job. All you need is blood. <laughs> <laughs> well, blood well, is well, all you well. need. <laughs> all you need is blood. Don't talk to blood. me. I, I didn't know if they were going to be uh, laughing again. Oh. <laughs> so I'm assuming there's no point at this game, in this game rather, where you're like, oh, that's why that's that way. It's just. Yeah. It's just, yeah. it just is. Because he's dead. Yeah. So. But he's just a ghost. Yeah, basically. With really sick t-shirts. <laughs>
bad girl, yes. bad girl. Seek the queen. Gatekeeper is in charge of the queen. Give this to the gatekeeper. Oh, he just gave me something. A ghost something. gave me something. Pop the truck. Here's your first soul shot. Bullet received soul shell. It's Matt holding a game. Dinner new. All right, guys. So that was interesting, to say the least. Uh, that was an experience. Say that much. Um, so I definitely am going to play this game with Tristan in the future. I don't know if it'll be through the GameCube or Steam. Yeah, because it is on Steam. Yes, too. and you were going to get it through Steam, so yeah. we might be doing it live on our Twitch. Okay. So if it is, you can definitely follow our social media, and that's how you'll find out. Uh, but I, I do think that if we do it live on Twitch, it doesn't necessarily mean that we can't do it here. Mm. It's just really more of availability of when you and I can get together. Yeah. And also something we remember, too, because when I was saving off-camera, uh, I saw that there was a save file from, like, 09 on your memory card. Yeah. And I was like, wait. Because I remember you played it, but I thought you played it at a friend's house with a friend's memory card. Yeah, we mm. did for a while. But... Did you borrow the game? Yeah, I borrowed it at one point. Okay. That was also another point of why that's, we haven't done it in which, a while. Which, yeah, it hit us. I my own copy yet. It hit us, like, literally right the second. Yeah. I was like, right, you just got it this past calendar year. Yeah. You were, and because I remember yeah. you've been telling me for a while, Matt, can you tell me, you were like, yeah. Matt, can you help me out? I don't Maybe ask finding you a things. good deal. Yeah. Not paying for it, but just find a good deal. Yeah. And out of nowhere, I was like, dude, I just looked it up on eBay. It's a good deal. And you were like, but I specifically looked at you, I'm like, wait, it's the GameCube version, right? Yes, and of course. Like, yes. Uh, cause you, not that you enjoy it more, it literally runs better, that's what yes. you say. Yeah. Okay. The graphics-wise and like loading times mm -hmm. are much better on the GameCube. Okay. So if you're not looking for it on Steam, yeah, my recommendation would be go for the GameCube version. But the problem is that it's not like super duper cheap. It's, it's not, not easy to it's find. It's not either. Grail territory. No. Like it's no. not over $100, no. but you got it for a steal at what, 40 yeah. So you you consider that a steal? Some, oh, for this, hell yeah. Yeah, because you've Personally. seen it, you've seen it higher. Yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. I've right, seen then. it like fifty, sixty, and I was like, oh, okay. I want to. And like, again, we're not saying it should be. We're just that's what we've yeah, seen it at. So, right. but it's not like crazy hundred dollar more territory no. like some other GameCube no. games out there. To be fair, so yeah. that's good. But either way, though, I had a lot of fun with this. Can't wait to play this, and honestly, might even come out with a review by this year. Um, because of course this is, this is coming out in the future. Yeah. So I was like, no, not by, yes, by the, um, <laughs> no, because I do want to play this even just on my downtime. This is very weird and interesting and it's so unique and I can see why so many people praise it because it's just so different and it's one of those things, dude, where I, I've played a few, um, on rail shooters now and again, you know, like time crisis or Pokemon snap, but, uh, I, Actually, I haven't played Pokemon Snap, but it basically is an on-rail shoot. He's not wrong. So, <laughs> uh, point being, though, guys, is that I've played enough either in arcades or at home to see something like this and go, wow, like, if anyone was tired of on-rail shooters, play this. Yeah. It's weird. Yeah. Like, this is just different enough, I think, to uh, just, just maybe revitalize your love yeah. of it. Or if this is your first one... And Maybe you think like differently. Of it's them. not just weird <laughs> for the sake of being weird, too. Well, like there well, is there is a deeper story. Oh, okay. Of course, we're yeah. only in the first twenty minutes, but yeah. I mean, even if it, I just think that it's weird. But here's the thing: weird for the sake of being weird. It's not that it's okay, but like it doesn't seem like Suda sat there and thought, "Let me put in something weird." Yeah. He was just like, "Wait, I can put things... in anything." Right. Wait, I, can put, I, I can just put this in, and then that's when he was like, "Like I feel like he put in that character, uh, the one who is um, what he was our." Yeah, he was on. Yeah. As like a, they're not gonna let me do this, and then they did, and he was like, o "Okay, what else can I put in?" Right. <laughs> it it then, kind of feels like that, yeah. where it's just like, what weird stuff can I get away with? And for some reason, uh, Konami, who made this, Capcom, um, yes, Capcom. Capcom. Sorry, yeah. Capcom was like, "No, nah, no, no, go nuts!" Like, okay, uh, so yeah, I'm I, again just having a lot of fun with this. Can't wait to play some more of it. And as always, thank you all so much for tuning in. As always, if you like the video, please remember to like and subscribe. And if you didn't, you can still like and subscribe either way. And uh, comment down below with your thoughts on this game if you've played it in the past. Uh, yeah, it's just, it's nuts. I love it. <laughs>
Tristan, you've been right all along. So... Thank you. <laughs> he's like... <laughs> Validation? You're basically Travis. You're just a ghost all this whole time, and you're just going to float up into the sky right now. I'm not letting you go anywhere, Smith. <laughs> all right. Take care, everybody. See ya.